ridiculous. I'm officially screwed already. I have zero dollars. Hello, welcome to 8-Bit Armies. I'm joined by Alex today. Say hi, Alex. Hi. Uh, he's currently not able to join me. However, for the sake of playing the game, here I am. Alright, that'll have to do. <laughs> that, that's it? Are we done? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> me and Sean, um... Our intros always suck. Who cares about intros? It's about yeah. content. Content, content, content. Content's good. Uh, one of our intros was entirely us discussing what our intro should be. You know... <laughs> that doesn't surprise me. <laughs> yeah. I feel like that should be the subject of all intros. You know, instead of thinking about an intro, why don't you just like make a set intro? Power plant complete. Like, just put some like awesome montage together. This is true. I should do this. I'm gonna have to at some point. It's just, I don't know how to do any animation or anything. I feel like animation would look cool. Dude, I hear some rumbling thunder outside. I... Who's... Oh, God. I keep talking in all chat. I mean, to talk in team chat. And like... Um... <laughs> Are you just giving away secrets? Yeah, I'm like, not right at the moment, but last game I played, I was just talking about... Sorry. I was just talking about our plan, alright? I'm just gonna rush white when the game starts. And then I'm like in all chat, and the white guy's like, Dude, you're talking in all chat. I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> so I'm like, JK, JK, just kidding. <laughs> See, you probably already know more about the game than I do. I mean, like, I've watched videos on it, but I... I don't feel like there's that much to know. I don't know, there's there's all those, like, random hotkeys and stuff, and there's, like, certain ways to set things. See, I, I hardly know any of the hotkeys. You don't need to know the hotkeys, though, that's the thing. Yeah, you're probably quicker knowing them, but I don't know them, so... You'll We'll learn them. We'll learn them together. Sounds good. It's it's exactly like Halo, where it's just like a different look. Oh, yeah. I'm just going to build like helicopter pad. Just kind of rush these guys. Because our grace period set to five minutes, so once that hit, timer hits five, I'm freaking rushing this guy over there. Dude, the most annoying thing in the game that I've noticed from watching videos is just those stupid oil-like trucks. Yeah, they're retarded. Because, like, you'll, like, be trying to get money, and then you can't even get money because they're all just stuck. Yeah. So, like, you have to tell them where you want them to go. Plus, occasionally, they don't even listen to where you tell them to go. And also, if your oil, um, your oil rig runs out of oil, it'll just choose somewhere else to go. So often, I'll be playing with, like, teammates. Yeah, and it'll start stealing power. And I'll just go over there, and the dude's, like, freaking out chat, like, dude, what the hell are you doing? But honestly, how can people get mad? We all know that the things are retarded. True. Well, that's beta for you. <laughs> yeah. The AI needs some serious work. The AI for, like... Everything. Eh, I wouldn't say everything. Well, not everything. Like, some of the fighting units are actually decent. Well, the AI that you fight, you go from, like, beginner, which is, like... Oh, yeah. Right, yeah, this is good, and then you get to their base, and it's like really easy to destroy their base on beginner. But then you put it on normal, and they just like 
they just rush you out the ass, and you're you're done. They're, hard, they're hardcore. Like that, that's only one thing up. There's like still like what two other difficulties or something. I don't know. Yeah. Like what the hell? That's ridiculous. I'm officially screwed already. I have zero dollars and I have two freaking mining rate mining things, or oil things, but they suck. They're terrible. Oh, I just ran out of power. Do you know how to expand your, like, zone? Oh, yeah. I just build turrets all the way out to where I want to go. Yeah, yeah, Okay. So I'll just, like, build us to the center of the map and just build a bunch of refineries with all the things. Yeah. That works out. That way, and then always destroy your old refineries, too. Oh, uh, sure. Delete them, because they'll always go back, like, to the original, too. Oh, uh, yeah. So that way you, s and they, you save money the closer... The less they have to travel. Oh, it's five minutes. I didn't kill anybody. Crap. Well, there goes that plan. And I don't have enough money to expand outwards either. Yeah, you get to the point where you just have to like delete some of your buildings because <laughs> you're out of money. I'm legit very poor right now. There, there is a lot of strategy in that game. Oh yeah. And I mean, you, you could play intense. defensively. You could play defensively and get totally screwed over by a horde of helicopters. Defense is not the way to go. No, it's it's terrible. Really. They're, all the defense things that they have are awful. Yeah. They don't really do anything. That's why. You, that's probably why, like, when you play II, it's so difficult because the defense is awful in the game. Nothing can be worked on. I mean, hey, it's been out for what, like, ten days or something. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, you can't blame them. I think it's like two. I think it's two guys who made this whole game. Like, All that's right. not bad for two guys. Oh yeah. All right, I'm finally about to. Move up in life to get some more oil refineries. Oh yeah, the, the other team, uh, the enemy didn't claim the other ones either. So I've got the ones in the one area. Yeah, I don't know what map you're playing on or anything. So <laughs> it's oh, from the enemy. Uh, it's kind of like diamond shaped, like a sideways square. One person each corner, two people in the middle. 3v3. And two people in the middle? Yeah, 3v3. That's weird. Yeah, it is. At least if you're in the back, you're kind of protected. Oh, yeah, I'm, in, I'm in all the way in the back. Oh, so they're not even going to probably go after you first. No, our guy that's in the middle, he's currently, like, he's expanded to the back of the map with the two of, with our, um, our two teammates, the two of us. See, I wish you could build another HQ. You can't do this. Pretty much Halo Wars, yeah. Which is like, unless you destroy your HQ and rebuild it in the back. True. That's what you would have to do. That's what the guys, I think, it looks like he's doing. Which I, which I hate, because like in Halo Wars, you just move to like an open base location, you can build another one. Yeah. That's what I like about that. So hopefully like they add something like that. Because if you can't build another HQ until you... The, main one is destroyed that's kind of stupid yeah I got it needs to be like you need to be able to like conquer like the land and like overpower the other bases mm. oh shoot I'm gonna run myself out of power again I keep doing that all right you gotta stay caught up on that oh shoot this guy's trying to get oil from me screw him <laughs> I'm gonna blow him up Oh, no, Jesse's texting me. Isn't that the way it always is? As soon as I start doing something, I get a text.
Alright, I'm just gonna go the strategy of building a horde of helicopters. Everyone else does it, so I might as well. Now it is true it's annoying that you can't build a second base, but if you could, it would get really freaking hectic. Because this game's pretty fast paced compared to Halo Wars. Power plant complete. Constructing. Oh. I'm sure you can just hear my phone buzzing like crazy. I did just hear it now. I haven't heard it though before then. Machine gun turret complete. Constructing. Oh, shoot, our teammate's under attack now. Wait. Oh, he's probably been under attack. Shoot. <laughs> I think he's actually been under attack. I've been kind of just chilling. I'm just so distracted right now. <laughs> <laughs> when Bay when is upset. Alright. Oh, our white teammate died. Except I think he's just gonna rebuild his base. Yep. Come on, take him out. Oh god, they're waiting for me. There are a lot of turrets in defense. I wouldn't even be playing multiplayer yet. <laughs> oh lordy. I don't know why you're playing multiplayer, you're better off playing the AI right now. Actually... I mean, oh, obviously shoot. people have been playing the game more than you. Oh no, the other, the other teammate of theirs came in to help. Yeah, that's how you gotta do it. This is why I need the game. I actually took out five of their turrets, though. So I weakened them a lot. Except the part I just rebuild. And I just used up a lot of guys. It still worked, though. Kinda. Huh. I was hoping to get them by surprise. Didn't work quite well. At least I got my teammates over here, though, at least. Dude, I have all these freaking college emails. Right. This is ridiculous. Literally all of this <laughs> is... Oh man, the other 
guy in the freaking middle is OP. So many freaking turrets. Can you send money to other people or anything? You can't. Yeah, I got stuck with one dollar earlier after getting killed, and I had my new base down. One dollar, I couldn't build a factory. So I was just kind of stuck. Yeah. So I don't think you can get more money from teammates. I'm sure they're going to be adding all sorts of stuff. Yeah, definitely. I mean, they're getting a bunch of feedback from the community right now, so... Yeah. They'll see what people want most. When, when I'm poor and looking at the free-to-play games on Steam. <laughs> Sometimes you occasionally find something good to pass the time. Well, the, now that I have Windows on here, I can freaking... True. Uh, this game is called Epic Clicker Journey. Oh, God almighty. Don't play a clicker. I, I played them. I got addicted. It's dangerous. What do you do? Click. That's it? Yeah, if you see any game called Clicker, it's a freaking click game. You sit there and click to get money, and then you automate stuff to get money for you, and then you keep clicking. It's basically all about clicking. Wow. I used to do those on my phone. They're, they're addicting and cancerous. The sad part is right now I feel like I'm doing okay as far as my base goes, but somehow I still I just don't have a good army. I might need more uh Wow well, this was cool if I had a VR set. Oh yeah. I have Dominator V2 HDs, but those are more meant for FPV flying than PC gaming. Yeah, I have this well, there's this game. It's called The Lab. It's a compilation of Valve's room scale VR experiments. Ah. Set in a pocket universe within Aperture Science. Fix a robot, sweet? defend a castle, adopt a mechanical dog, and more. <laughs> but, like, you know, no VR. <laughs> Yeah. I feel like that'd be really fun to play. Yeah. <clears throat> IKEA VR experience. Oh God, I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> For the lazy people that don't feel like going to Ikea. Yo, I would actually check that out, though. That'd be pretty sweet. I, you, have, you have to remind me after this match to go check that out, because I wouldn't mind seeing that, how that works. The Ikea VR experience. It's got to be good, though. It can't be some crap. Put on your VR headset and prepare to explore a kitchen solution in full 3D. You'll be able to walk around and interact with objects just like you were there. All right, sounds awful. <laughs> Open drawers and put your vegetable peelings in the waste sorting station. You can even enjoy the visual impact of different material finishes and experience things from a child's point of view. A child? Why? I think this is actually... Stupid. I don't know. <laughs> I... I don't know why I'm not getting any money right now. Maybe it's because of the amount of troops I'm making or something. Oh, shoot. That's a lot of tanks. Nice. Dude, I'm just like so happy now, because now I can play any game. True. You can also Wait. play Skyrim now. No, I'm not paying for Skyrim. No, you should. I'm just kidding. I'm I'm really just kidding though. I am poor. Skyrim's pretty awesome though. Um, help. Oh shoot. 
I'm looking at all the like games that are early access right now. Oh look, this one's called Skies and it's free to play. The Skies is a unique combination of post-apocalyptic MMO, RPG, and FPS with a non-linear storyline. Follow your own path and join other players to conquer the wasteland. The sweet breath. If only I could transfer my iTunes money to Steam. <laughs> oh, you can do that on some things you can. Oh, uh, if it's in a gift card, uh, you can. I don't know about the regular though. No, it's like I already put the gift card in my thing. Uh, probably can't then. There's like $15 left or something. Ah. Uh. Whatever. I literally have to wait till tomorrow. I'm just really impatient. <laughs> ah, that's good. Nothing wrong with that. Welcome to America. <laughs> where people being impatient is rising. Yeah. <laughs> ADD is on the rise. <laughs> I'm officially out of money. Pretty much all the mining rigs are just con completely consumed. The oil rigs? Yeah, that happens. Then it comes down to the fight of whoever has things and they survive. I feel like I'm pretty well off. Um, Alright, well I saw all of my mining rigs. So now I just gotta... Oh, why is my entire army just kind of freaking moving around there? Oh, they're tomorrow. I'll do a team thing. Holy crap! I got so many helicopters. I think it's funny how I literally showed you this game today, and you bought it and are playing it already. It would look too good. I'm sorry to get it for you, but I, I really don't it. care because I'm getting it tomorrow. True. And like, I would be too tired to actually play it tonight anyway. Oh like, my getting pretty tired. <laughs> this guy's. When I feel like this isn't even a video. We're just No! No! Somebody nuked my helicopters! Oh, that was terrible. I feel yeah, like they made me. Oh, you always gotta be on top of that. You always gotta like m be ready to move all your shit out of the way. Oh yeah, right when it hit, I was moving them. But there are so many of them they just couldn't move fast enough. Well, somebody's gonna get a nuke back, cause now I'm mad. That's probably why those hotkeys would help. Yeah, true. Except I, I don't even know what you could do with the hotkeys. I have no idea. Oh shoot! I can make more helicopters. I know a lot about the game, but I also know not a lot about the game. <laughs> I'm trying to think of this. What's that one? Quantum Break. Have you heard of that game? No. I think it's like an Xbox One exclusive or something. Ah. Huh. I don't know, but it looks pretty fucking good. Oh, I turns out I had a load of freaking troops back in my base that I just forgot about completely. It's an interesting game because like it also has um. It's also like half of a TV, it's also like half TV show. So like, ah. play the game and then like, you play through like one chapter of the game and then like the next chapter is a TV show for like 30 minutes. Sounds familiar. And then you like, then you go back into the game. And like you can put, like, the whole like thing with the game is like time is broken and like you have the ability to like pause time and shit. It, it's a really interesting game. No. Oh.
I can't believe some of these games <laughs> on Steam right now. They're like it's like fourteen dollars to like this one game's called Poly Bridge. It's twelve bucks to buy. And you just build like bridges. You could probably get the same thing as an app for like two bucks on your phone. Yeah, I saw that game. Well, let's see. What what demos do they have that I can just download and play? Cause I'm poor. <laughs> well, oh, what was that other game that would be a good one to play? Shell Shock. Have you seen that game? No. Don't remember. Shell Shock Live. Seven bucks. It's a seven dollar game. You know, like that old tank game everybody used to play. World tanks. Uh, I don't know if that's what it is. It's like the two D tank game where you just like shoot your friends. Nuke! 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 Oh, I got out of there just in time. Oh, thank God! My entire freaking army nearly got nuked. Dang. That would have just annihilated my entire game. The next game we should buy is definitely should definitely be this game. Which game? Shell Shock Live. Ah. It's seven bucks, but like there's so much content to it. But yeah, you basically just fire its tanks against tanks. And you just get like different weapons and stuff. Ah. It's still early access right now, so the the um, price is probably gonna go up a lot. Yeah. Oh sweet, they have it for Mac too. One of us could just buy the four pack and gift it. <laughs> There's a four pack? The four pack is 20 bucks. Oh. What is this game? It's. Well, you can look it up after you're done. Alright, sorry, I'm in like mega concentration mode here. I feel. This shit is hype. The viewers are just like. They're like watching you and they're listening to me talk about other games. <laughs> I can't even talk to them right now because I'm so focused. There's just so much crap going down. This reminds me of when I watched um, you and Sean play The Walls. Oh my god, yeah. That video. <laughs> Where you fell off with all the TNT and then Sean was screwed. <laughs> yeah. Good times. I wasn't. I think your recording was. Um, the video quality on that one was a little weird. I don't remember. I think it was that one. Yeah, it was like 480 instead of 720 or something. Really? Yeah. I could have sworn I fixed that. Maybe you did. I don't know. When I was watching it a while ago, it was wet. It was messed up. Ah. Uh. Well, I just did a flank on red base and killed their HQ. Keep attacking. So 3v3, take I pretty much took out green and red. Take out, t always take out their power supply. Oh yeah, I didn't annihilate it. They don't have any power left. Perfect. That's like the number one thing, because then like turrets go out and they can't make any more units or anything. Or like it gets slowed down or I forget what it does. Hey, ever, I'm uh, gonna probably going to be getting off here, so you're stuck with the viewers being silent. <laughs> um, I'll have to make a cover agree. I'm going to have to download the team speak. You oh, get the, 
Get Discord, because this game uses Discord. It does? Yeah. Alright. Well, oh, I'll shoot. Go. This guy fun. annihilated my helicopters. Alright. Yeah, get Discord, because that's what we use anymore. Our um, entire TCHS group has a server we all use. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Alright. Well, yeah, I'll worry about that tomorrow, then. Alright. I'll see it. See it. Bye, viewers. They say bye. Just us now. Oh, this was a really good match. I thought I was gonna get screwed over at one point, but I made a comeback. Semi comeback. Boom. That's a GG. What else is left? I think that's it. Man, I only had these troops right here left as well. That was a close one. Oh, I feel like I was a, I was a hyper carry, not quite a hyper carry, but I was a bit of a carry. I mean, I saved one guy. Pretty much focus helicopters became too OP. Yeah, forty-four thousand resources thanks to being in those mines there. Two hundred fifty-one helicopters, pretty much. Oh, the blue guy beat me in units. Um, one hundred ninety-nine killed. Uh, and the blue guy there, he pretty much focused black, which caused all the unit kills. Yeah, it looks like I was kind of the best averaged out. Besides blue. But I pretty much found him and destroyed him. Wow. That was a tiring match. That was a really good match, so I'm happy with that. One of my first multiplayer victories as well. Just got the game like three hours ago. Alright, well thanks for watching everyone. I will see you next time. Goodbye.